Hello, good afternoon everyone. So this is our fourth week. Our topic this afternoon is all about physical fitness. But before that, this is our objectives. A. Identify the physical activities that aid in the development of different physical fitness components. B. Explains the concept of physical fitness. C. Analyze the different principles of fitness training. Physical fitness is the body, body's ability to function effectively and efficiently without undue fatigue in work, leisure activities to meet emergency situations, and to resist diseases from a sedentary lifestyle. There are three point important aspects that an individual should be able to meet in order to be considered physically fit. Number one, ability to perform one's daily tasks without undue fatigue. These daily activities include getting early for school, walking, traveling to school, listening, or participating to class activities, contributions to the workload in the house. Number two, enjoying leisure through some recreational activities. Leisure is the amount of time left after all. The daily routine activities are accomplished. It is an unobligated time where one can enjoy through activities such as sports, academic games, and other productive hobbies. These activities are called recreation. They may be in the form of play puzzles and other brain games, listening to music, playing games or sports, dancing. Meeting Emergencies are, uh, are unforeseen even where one has to use his energy and time to meet unexpected circumstances. They include accidents, participating in community service, solving household problems, illnesses, death in the family, calamities, landslides, earthquakes, fire, floods, etc. Health-related fitness components, muscular strength, the ability of the lungs, heart, and blood vessels to deliver adequate amounts of oxygen to the cells to meet demands of pro prolonged physical activity. Flexibility, the ability of the muscles and joint to go through a full range of motion. Body composition refers to proportion of lean body mass to fat body mass. Muscular endurance defined as the maximum pull of push that can be exerted one time by a muscles group. Skill-related fitness. Fitness components important for success in skills and skillful activities and athletic events. Speed. The ability to perform a task or move from one point to another in the shortest possible time. Agility, the ability of an individual to quickly shift or change direction of the body from one point to the other. Power, the ability to perform one maximum effort in the shortest possible time. It is the product of both strength and speed. Balance, the ability to stay in a equilibrium in, relations, in relation to change in body position. It may be static or dynamic. Static balance is the kind of balance demonstrated in a stationary position. Dynamic balance is demonstrated while the body is moving. Recreation time is the amount of time it takes to respond to the stimulus. Coordination is the integration with hand and or foot movements with the input in the senses. Health benefits of exercise and exercise exercise program. Improve coordination. Increase muscular strength, endurance, and motor fitness. Improve muscle tone and strength. Weight management. Better coordination, agility, and flexibility. Improve balance and spatial awareness. Increase ener energy levels. Reduce risk of chronic, such as type 2 diabetes and heart disease. 
improve sleep and brain health, improvise general and, and psychological well-being. Principles of fitness training. Principle of overload is the most basic of all fitness training principle. It specifies that you must perform physical exercise the normal amounts overload to get an improvement in physical fitness and health benefits. Principle of specificity indicates that you must train an uh, energy system and specific muscle groups in order for them to improve. Example, if you want to develop the cardiovascular endurance, you must design a training program that primarily utilizes particular energy system. Principles of progression indicates that load could be increased gradually over time to remain effective and safe the, for the best results. An individual training to gain cardiorespiratory endurance may begin in an exercise program by jogging 2 kilometers at a moderate intensity. Principle of Variation There are many different ways to achieve desired fitness goals, including variation. A training program trains individuals' interests and provides a change of based whole still making progress toward desired goals. Principles of recovery. The body needs time to adapt to the demand, demands placed on it. Incorporating time to test into the fitness program aids the body in this effort. For example, an individual may work one day on improving upper body strength and devote the next day's training to working lower body strengths. Applying the basic training principles, frequency, refers to the number of exercise sessions per week, for example, three to five times per week. Intensity is the degree of effort or exertions put worth by an individual during exercise. Time is the durations of the length of the, cap of the activity, such as 40 minutes of exercise, is how long an exercise must be performed to be effective. Type is the mode of exercise being performed. The selections of the type of exercise should be guided by the fitness goal to achieve. Finding the right intensity. There are several ways in which you can monitor your cardiovascular response to physical activity. The most common way is by measuring your heart rate response. Heart rate is counted by putting slight pressure on any artery in the body where pulsations can be felt. The pulse rate or heart rate is the number of times the heart beats per minute. These rates change depending on activity levels when you calm and relax. Your pulse is lower, and that is your resting heart rate. Resting heart rate chart. So, age of fitness level, beat per minutes or BPM, children aged 11 to 17. So, 60 to 100. How to measure resting heart rate? Resting heart rate should be measured first thing in the morning with your index and middle finger and stopwatch. Put your middle and index to either your radial artery on your wrist or your cathode artery in your neck. Once you you this number by six, six, that is your resting pulse. So resting heart rate examples eleven. So beats in ten seconds times six equals sixty six BPM beats per minute. Maximum heart rate or HRMEX is the fastest that your heart can when doing activities. So formula HRMEX equals 220 plus age. Example 220 minus 12 equals 208 BPM. Target heart rate or training heart rate or THR is a desired range of the heart rate reached during aerobics exercise, which enables heart, one's heart and lungs 
to receive the most benefits from a workout. In this method, there is an element called intensity as a percentage. The THR can be calculated as the range of 85, 65 to 85% intensity. So this is the example on how to get target heart rate calculation. Flexibility exercise. This phase of exercise follows immediately after warm-up rate and heart rate. This helps increase the body's core temperature while also increasing the body's muscles temperature through an increase in the delivery of oxygen and nutrients to the working muscles. A warm-up should consist of light physical activity for 5 to 15 mi minutes of exercise, such as walking and slow jogging. Which stretching work best? Static stretch are more appropriate in the cold down as they help muscles to relax, realign re muscle fibers, and re-establish their normal range of movement. This stretch should be held for at least 10 seconds. Dynamic stretching. Exercise especially prepare the muscles for active contraction. However, they do not cause long-term improvement in flexibility be because of the short stretching time. Here are some examples of dynamic warm-up exercise that you may want to use before involving in vigorous activities. Individual sports. In a sport in which participants complete as individuals. Brief history of swimming. Swimming can be date back to the Stone Age but did not truly become an organized sport until the early 19th century. An ancient discipline, prehistoric men learned to swim in order to cross rivers and lakes. We know this because caves paintings from the Stone Age depicting swimmers have been found in Egypt. Swimming was also referred to in Greek mythology. Olympic History Swimming has featured on the program of all editions of the Games since 1896. The very Olympic events were freestyle or crawl or breaststroke or backstroke was added in 1904. It was first introduced in the Olympic Games in Athens year 1896. And in 1908, the World Swimming Association was introduced called Federation International de Na de Nation or fi FINA in the 1940. Breaststrokers discovered that they could go faster by bringing both arms forward over their heads. This practice was immediately forbidden and breaststroke but gave birth to butterfly. Equipment and swimming. Equipment ranged in purpose from tools used in co competitive swimming or for reaction. This equi equipment is used to help the swimmers move and perform efficiently. Goggles, swim cap, kickboard, starting block, touch pad, swimming trunks, starting gun, swimming suit, pins, learning how to swim, any of the basic swimming strokes is an essential skill in life and learning how to swim smooth, effortless swimming techniques is not difficult if we only know the techniques. So strokes, characteristics and procedures, front crawl, popularly known as freestyles, fastest and the most efficient swimming techniques, procedure, the body is in the prone position, involves alternating overarm strokes and the platter kick. The, the, le the head remains in the water face alternating from side to side. So that is front crawl. Butterfly strokes is the powerful and graceful techniques. The most difficult and exhausting stroke. So procedures, hands enter the water should shoulder with a part. Legs move in fish tail or dolphin kick. Arms move up and down. War worn shoulders. Rotate bringing arms around. Breaststroke. 
the slowest of the four official styles in complete swimming, requires comparable endurance and strength to other strokes. So, procedure. The legs remains extended back and the feet don't st start to come up to sit up the kick until the arms are turning the corner to start recovery. The feet push back on the water on the end of recovery, then the arms are extended in front of the head is in line. Backstroke has the advantage of easy breathing, but the ad disadvantage of swimmers not be being able to see where they are going. The only competition swimming style that has a different start. Procedures push up the wall on your back in a streamlined position while you are still underwater in a streamlined position. Begin several dolphin kicks prior to raising the surface. As you emerge from the water, pull your bottom hand through the backstroke. Pull pattern as quickly as possible. History of Athletics It contains in running, walking, jumping. Athletics contains in running, walking, jumping, and throwing are among the oldest of all sports and the roots are prehistoric. Athletics events were depicted in the ancient Egyptian tombs in Saqqara with illustrations of running at the herb, seed festival, and high jumping appearing in tombs from an early as of 2250 BC. The original and only event Facilities and equipments used in athletics, track oval, high jump, baton, spike shoes, starting gun, starting block, hurdles, landing pit or long jump, shot put, discus, hammer ball. Jogging is a form of running at a slow or leisurely pace. The main intention is to increase physical fitness with less stress on the body than from fasting running, faster running or to maintain a steady speed for a longer period of time. Perform over long distance. It is a form of aerobics endurance training. A person can find place to jog almost everywhere. The one requirement to prevent injuries is a good pair of shoes. The benefits of jogging. It's one of the most efficient way to achieve aerobics fitness. It helps you lose weight. It can be done inexpensively it convenience its convenience indoor or out or out it's good stress reliever you can run alone or with others for social interaction prevent diseases relieves stress so levels of intensity low intensity heart rate 70 to 110 beats per minute Moderate intensity, heart rate is 120 to 160 beats per minute. High intensity, heart rate is more than 170 beats per minute. So rating or perceived exertions, level of intensity, rating of perceived ex exertion, physical cues, talk test. Treating sports injuries, muscle sprain, sprain an abnormal stretching or tearing of a ligament that supports a joint. Follow the RICE method to keep your injury from getting worse. R. Rest the injury. I. Ice the injury to lessen swelling, bleeding, and inflammation. C. Apply a compression bandage to minimize swelling. E. Elevate the injury to reduce swelling. Muscle cramps is a sudden contraction of muscle that may feel extremely painful. First aid treatment, muscle cramps. Cramps usually will relieve on their own without treatment. Make sure always calm down and relax by heaving slow deep breathing through mouth. To speed the healing process, we can gently stretch and massage the cramping muscles. Apply an ice massage to the cramped muscles. If leg cramps, polish retaining the leg and binding over the grabbing Grabbing the end of the tooth, the cramp will eventually relieve. Applications of muscle paint to relieve the cream, 
drink beverage con contain potassium such as water, heat exhaustion, a condition usually develops gradually and caused by loss of salt and water from, from the body through excessive sweating. It is more common in persons who are accused to exercise in a hot, humid environment. First aid treatment, heat exhaustion. Help the athlete to lay down in a cold place, raise and support her legs. Raising the legs improves blood flow to the brain, provided the athlete and conscious help her to sip plenty of weak salt solution or one teaspoon per liter of water. If recovery is rapid, advise the casualty to see her own doctor. If the athlete becomes unconscious, place her in the recovery position. Call your local emergency number for an ambulance. So, any clarifications about our topic this afternoon? So, thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much.